Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your girl, Christy, and welcome to my channel. Real quick, if you hear all of that in the background, that is the radio. My aunt is doing her thing, and she's also getting ready for work. Um, but I do want to come on here and just open the vlog. I am about to start a three-day trip. If you didn't know, I'm officially New York-based, so I'm heading to JFK Airport. It is 716. My sign-in is at 855. Um... I am taking public transportation, so I'm going to try to get, like, um, some B-roll and footage of that so y'all can see what my commute is like. It's really not that bad. I'm a New Yorker, so me taking a bus and train is nothing. Um, but yeah, I am working this week, okay? I am working. I'm on basically a nine-day stretch, and I'll probably talk to y'all about that later and how that's even legal. But, um yeah it's getting money time like we have so much to talk about <laughs> let me open the vlog and i'm gonna see y'all once i get to my layover Hey y'all, I finally made it to my hotel. Today was a long day, like a really long day. And what's crazy about it is it was a long day for me, but I feel like I didn't do anything. So this morning we started from at JFK. We went from JFK to Orlando. Sat in Orlando for almost two hours. And a sit is basically like a break in between our flights. And then um, after that, almost two hour sit we deadheaded from Orlando to Atlanta and basically a deadhead is where we're paid we're working and we're paid to be a passenger to get to wherever we need to go to support the needs of the company um so we deadhead from Orlando to Atlanta and then we sit for three hours like <laughs> and then after the three hours we worked the flight from Atlanta to Memphis so really though total we probably sat for like five and a half hours we sat more than we flew today so it was a really long day um for me i'm someone who likes to stay busy so the minute that i'm just sitting there not doing anything it makes me sleepy and like i couldn't read because i was falling asleep like i was on the flight my dad had flight trying to read and i was like i can't do this baby i need to watch youtube or something because that book was putting me to sleep but um yeah that was that i actually got some work done i actually um created some content i'm almost finished editing my vlog <coughs> it would have already been up by this time excuse me i'm actually getting sick i've been wearing a mask all day um but yeah so that's how that went it's just been a long day but it was still productive and it was still an easy day. Crew was great. Um, customers were great. Just an easy day. The flights weren't super full. Then, I told y'all earlier that I was going to get into some tea with y'all as far as works and trip, work and trips are concerned. So, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> okay? But, there has been no trips on our work board. Like, we have a board where you can drop your trips for other flight attendants to pick up, or you can swap with them, and you or, and, or you can pick up, right? 
there is nothing out there. There is absolutely nothing out there. It's so bad that flight attendants are emailing other flight attendants to take their trips. It's so bad that people are picking up reserve days just to work. Like, it's nothing. There's never been a time other than COVID that I will go and look at this board and not be able to pick up anything. So last week, I had a trip and I put all my trips in, you know, um, New York to drop so I can go home and pick up whatever I need to pick up out of Atlanta. I do that, somebody picks up my three day trip. I go to Atlanta, can't pick up nothing. And it's even worse when I'm no longer based there because the people who are based in Atlanta gets to pick first. Whatever's left is available to people who are out of the base like me. So that's dead, I can't do that no more. I can't pick up out of Atlanta. Um, so when I saw that there were no trips, I was like, well, dang, let me go back to New York and see if I can pick up a trip. Nothing. I'm like, are you for real? There was nothing. So I was off <laughs> all week last week. So I was like, I mean, it felt good. That's cute or whatever, but I need to work. So usually towards like the end of the year, I try to go in like mid-December to mid-January, put a little extra in my pocket, you know what I'm saying, to start the new year off right, also recoup from the holidays. November, December is a very, are very expensive months for me, so in August because my birthday, but those are the, the months where I spend the most money, so I kind of like to recoup, um, so that's what I'm doing, and because of last week, I had to work a little extra this week. So, I'm on a nine-day stretch, which I would never do this. I'm going to be exhausted, but I'm going to push through. Um, so, this is a three-day trip. Tomorrow, we go to San Francisco, and then the next day, we just from San Francisco to JFK, we done. My next trip, don't know where I end up, like, I don't know where I go, but my layover is somewhere. I don't even know the layover, honestly. I don't know the city code, but my layover is, like, 29 hours, so I can rest and actually do something, you know? Um, and then I have a two day trip after that. That kind of goes into the third day. So yeah, I think I'm, I'm gonna be fine, but I haven't done this in a minute. Like I think the last time I did this was like my first year flying. <laughs> um, because nine days is way too much, but Yeah, that's it. I've been wanting to come to this layover, to this hotel all day. Um, what else do I want to tell you? I want to catch up. Content. <laughs> okay, content. I want y'all to know, I got here at like, I want to say 9 o'clock. Let's say 9 o'clock. I got to the hotel. I got to the room. It's, I've been filming for an hour and a half. I've been filming for an hour and a half. And I left my tripod for my camera at home in Atlanta. So it was a struggle. Like right now I got y'all in the ice bucket. Like I really had to <laughs> improvise. So um, I'm doing my best. But trying to get B-roll, steady B-roll with no tripod is insane. Um, and I also like have my camera, my phone set up so I can film something on that camera too. But I'm proud of myself for doing that but I'm ready to go to sleep <laughs> I just wanted to check in with y'all talk to you about how today went what flying is like give you a little check in I'm about to make some tea <coughs> so I feel like I'm getting sick my throat a little itchy so I'm trying to fight that um and then I'm going to sleep that's it so let me stop talking <laughs> I will see you tomorrow. Hey, what's up, y'all? So, it is day three of the trip. I didn't get on at all yesterday. It was just, I was exhausted. So, um, last I told y'all, I was in Memphis. I went from Memphis to Atlanta. Um, and then had to sit for three hours. And then Atlanta to San Francisco. So, I'm in San Francisco right now. Um, I was dead tired. We got here maybe around like... 11 west coast time so what is that like one o'clock 
East Coast time. I got in so late. I didn't end up going to sleep until like 2, 3 o'clock just trying to get settled, take a shower and everything like that. Um, so I'm exhausted. It is 7.51 um, West Coast time. Our call time is at 10.45. So I'm just chilling. I got some ginger tea because I'm... I'm getting sick like my nose I felt a little congested and then I still have a cough so um, I'm hoping that I can get this out within the next couple of days <clears throat> stop it from getting like too serious you know but yeah I just wanted to get on here and just let y'all know because I didn't pick up this camera not once um, I'm going to give y'all a room tour but obviously like it's a mess <laughs> and it's been lived in um, so I'm going to show y'all my room and maybe do a little bit of me getting ready and then that's probably going to be it. Um, I get back to JFK today. We're done. Um, and then I go back out tomorrow. So hopefully today goes smooth, no delays. Um, and yeah, so I'm going to finish my tea and I'll talk to y'all in a little bit. Yes, I'm hurting, yes, I'm jaded Most of these things I don't want to say I don't want to be around while you chase You don't want to be young when you make me Do try and come back when you're famous I always want to do but it's dangerous You got something real, not basic You want to get with me, stop all right, y'all, so I know I told you I was going to give y'all a room tour, but honestly, the room looks a little crazy, and it's really not much to see here. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> oh, this vlog still comes out good. I'm going to go ahead and close it out right here. I need to fix my eyebrow. But I'm going to go ahead and close it out right here because I most likely will not get back on. Thank y'all so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!